Hello, welcome to Elevator Expeditions. We are in downtown Dallas at the Hilton Garden Inn, and here are the elevators. Now, um, something unusual about these elevators is that here it looks like there's a destination control panel, but it's only here in the lobby. Um, none of the other floors uh, have it, they just have ordinary buttons. So you can see the 18th floor is locked out. So um, let's start by going down to B1. So it tells us to go to car 7, which is this one here. Also that white button you see there, that's if um, for people who are sight impaired. Uh, it, it, um, there's an announcement comes on that lists all the floors and tells you to press button again when it gets to the number you want. Yeah, elevator seven and eight are the ones I've usually taken while I've stayed here at this hotel. So here it is. So it's going down. Nice floor in the cab. So you see the P1 button's already been lit because we pressed out there. This is car seven, capacity 3,000 pounds. Yeah, this is the basement. Gonna calibrate my app. Let's go up to 14. It's a little over 500 feet per minute. This, by the way, this building is much taller than a 14 stories. Um, above it, it's all apartments, and there's a different set of elevators for that. Here, there is a 13th floor. So we went about 207, 8 feet. Yes, it's 14. Okay, now let's go back down to 10, because that's where I'm staying. Interesting how the down arrow stops showing uh, on the side of Decatur there. You can hear the announcements. This is a ThyssenKrupp elevator. Whoops. There it goes. I'm just going to show you um, the view from here. It's so hard to see because it's dark out. That's the hotel pool down there. That's Elm Street. It's a Pegasus. Um, it's all part of the skyline. Comerica building. The key cards here are contactless. my room 1005 so just all right thank you for watching feel free to subscribe